Okay, let's see. Purple stuff. Ooh, milk. Mmm, it's like drinking straight from the cow. Of course, if you want to keep it authentic, you're gonna need an udder. Or at least a glove. Quick! Don't want you crying over spilled milk. This hot dog's getting all the worse. Mm, almost. Careful, save some for the sausage. Let's clean you up and give you a helping nose. Oh, it's a dispenser. Fill it with ketchup. Seal it up nice and tight. Give it a good squeeze. Finally, this hot dog's waited long enough. Now take a bite. Who wants some nice juicy pineapple? You'll notice I didn't say fresh. Be careful where you throw that thing. Told you not to pick from the bottom. Here, Mama has just what you need. A cute little car that also opens cans. It's all revved up. Let's take it for a spin. Would you look at that? The one time you're supposed to drive in a circle. Ooh, crepes. Let's fry it up. Huh, doesn't look too good. I know, some googly eyes will perk things up. And look, you can make him talk. But if you really want to have breakfast fun, try this dinosaur-shaped waffle maker. Just add batter into each dino shape. You know, a little food coloring can make a big difference. It's ready. Let's start with the Triceratops. Oh, Dino-licious. Someone passed the syrup. Oh, that bread is just within reach. At least we've got them down. Try this bag clip. Sure, it might be rude, but it sure helps put things together. How about we try it on an actual bag? Now let's get back to that bread. Fast food is sometimes food, and this is not one of those times. But we can still whip up a burger. A nice apple bun with a kiwi patty. And some apple fries on the side. Take a bite. It should be juicy. Growing girl needs her milk and dairy. How else could she use this ice cream roll pan? We'll need some chocolate shavings. Candies. Now it's about time we get things rolling. And get chopping while we're at it, too. Can't forget the chocolate sauce. And enjoy. Careful, it's cold. Mmm, rice. Oh, I told you to practice. Wait a second, I think something's inside. This'll help us make some adorable rice balls. Let's start with a cute cat-like shape. Next, we need to add some toppings. 
like some dried seaweed. This gives our cat some eyes and ears. Try one. No utensils required. Can't make an omelet without breaking some eggs. I like it a little crunchy, but not like this. Try this instead. It's an egg mold. Just crack an egg inside. And no shells. Close the lid and add to boiling water. Give it time to turn opaque. Not to mention cute. And more importantly, delicious. Careful, unless you're a clown, then it's a write-off. Either way, I'm pretty sure it's not edible. Well, if you're gonna eat things that look like candy, we might as well start making things out of candy. Enjoy, just don't eat the tube. Oh, lunch time. Could use some ketchup. At least it's not stuck in the bottle. Don't worry, this little piggy will help. Take the dispenser and fill it up with ketchup. Fill to the brim and reattach Mr. Piggy. Now ketchup is just a push of a button away. Don't like ketchup? Use whatever sauce you like. You can even mix sauces together if you want. You know, some people like to keep things in the bowl, present company included. Well, if she's gonna act like a baby, might as well look the part. Fill the special pacifier with smushed food. Just insert into the mouth and enjoy. Honestly, where does she pick up these habits? Never too young to learn about proper dental care. Or maybe you are. Luckily, ketchup's not the only thing that comes in dispensers. Add toothpaste and attach to the wall. Soon you'll be brushing those pearly whites. Eh, we can always brush after chocolate. There's always time for chocolate. If not, make time. After all that eating, could still use another snack. Watch your fingers. Oh no, I can't look. Those poor sausages. This won't happen again. We're prepared. Your hot dogs can rest easy with this door stopper. Oh, look there, a rubber ducky. And I'm over it. Look, a water ball. Just keep it away from your face. Here, let's put it down and fill it up with water. That should be enough. We don't want it to explode. After all, we can have much more fun jumping on it. Plus, it's the perfect pillow for a waterbed. And just in time for nap time, too. Okay, where does she keep getting treats? And can I have some? Don't be smug, you probably bought the candy. Still, we need to find some way to clean those teeth. This ain't your mama's toothbrush. I mean, it kind of is. You know what I meant. Just bite down and give it a good swish. Or let it shake, rattle, and roll for you. Let 
Let's leave the hairbirds to 18th century France. Besides, we've got a new gadget to try out. Just lock your hair in and get things started. Now it's time to start twisting those locks. And soon you'll have a head full of braids. <laughs> time for a bathroom break and a treat. Guess that's why people don't usually snack in here. Luckily, this special huh? lollipop holder can help. <laughs> Just open it up and it <laughs> shares the goods. Normally, you shouldn't share candy, but we can make an exception. Ooh. Well, while we're in here, might as well take a bath. Oh no! I guess either we ran out of the baby shampoo or they changed the formula. Huh? Don't worry, our furry friend's willing to share his comb. <laughs> In fact, he won't mind if you never give it back. <laughs> of course, a bubble beard won't hurt one bit. Huh? Wow, I guess you really can dig for treasures up there. Huh? Is it real wow. or candy? Either way, don't eat it. Let's see what else we can find inside her. Don't let the name fool you. It also works on noses. Well, would you look at that? She should be giving you an allowance. Now the tricky part, getting it out. See? Kids practically pay for themselves these days. Don't forget her cut, it's her nose. Does she know how to walk yet? Cause crawling's no good on the hands. Well, there's an easy fix. Wash those hands. Oh no, there's soap in the soup. Good thing mom brought dispensers on wholesale. Just lather up and rinse up. Just don't forget to leave some soap for the rest of us. Let's see how many bubbles you can blow. Well, that's a little less than I expected. Don't worry, we've got a seal to help. Or is it a sea lion? <laughs> I can never tell the difference. Well, whatever it is, look at all the bubbles it makes. It's okay if they pop. We've got plenty more where they came from. It's time for the final ping pong showdown. Well, when you're the only player, you win by default. Or lose. Maybe it's an automatic tie? Don't worry, there are other ways to ping pong. Even the solitaire version. Just hang this up, pull it down, and it's time to start paddling. Careful, it's like tetherball all over again. It's always important to keep hydrated. Just hold. Ooh, good thing it's sealed up tight. Ew, it's a mess. If only holding it was easier. Well, now it can be with this device. Just hook it up onto something sturdy. And attach the bottle at the end. Now let's see if she's ready to get back on the horse. Okay, she dropped it, but it didn't hit the floor. And it's all the easier to pick up. Something tells me that's gonna come in handy.
I guess she's full with all the snacks she's had. At least try the rice. It's such a great side dish. Oh no, such a waste of B vitamins. Don't worry, this fun plate will help. Especially if you don't like your food to touch. Plus some fun construction utensils. Can we eat it? Yes, we can. This is so fun, I think she'll even try something green. I think she likes it. Wait, you're supposed to be eating. Uh, oh well, catch you next time.